Salutations, spooks, spirits, and specters, and welcome to the Witch's House. An RPG horror game that uh, Legacorn got me quite a while ago. And now I'm going to go ahead and give it a playthrough. So let's begin. I did a little play testing just to get the audio setting right, so hopefully everything should be fine. Um... As much as I would like to play on normal, just for the ease of the let's play, I'm going to be playing on easy. So yeah. Yes, we will be playing on easy difficulty. Hurrah, hooray! Alright. Hello. So-and-so's house and out of the forest. Folks have taken up residence in this rotten log. You're up and at him, eh? Let's leave the forest. The way is blocked by a, startling hu a startlingly huge patch of roses. Found something rusty and sharp. Take it. Got a machete. Items are not used automatically. Stand in front of an object, and then select an item from the menu and use it. Some items will perform effects as long as you blah 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 blah. I wasn't paying attention. The cat is gone. The way is blocked by a small patch of roses. Oh, that's it. And there we go. The machete broke. Read. I don't mind if you go out to play, but don't go too deep into the forest. Hope to see you home soon. Dad. Huh? What is it? Hmm. The way out is blocked up by roses, huh? You got you gonna go in? Might as well if you can't leave. Yeah. Sorry, I, I I was pressing C because I'm so used to other kind of games of this particular <laughs> type where C is your run key. Let's go on in. avoid the blood. We wouldn't want to get our shoes. Come to my room. Okay. Oh, hello. Yo! Decided I'd follow you for laughs. Incidentally, where the heck do you come for out of from? I came out from the wall. A regular white wall. A vase of roses. A vase of roses. Can I leave? Eh? It won't open. The door is locked. Ellie, the door locks. A vase of roses. The basket has a big teddy bear in it. There's a little bit room. There's a little bit of room left. Bears in the basket. Bears in the basket, so I guess I need more. A large clock. Time marches on. It won't turn on. Witch's Diary. Sure, let's read it. I was sick, so no one played with me. My father and my mother didn't love me. Roses adorn the desk. It says, open when the house returns to normal. Okay. A teddy bear rests against a pile of presents. <coughs> Take the teddy bear. Got a teddy bear. A pile of presents and empty cookie tins. Wait, what? Could I not, like... That's weird. That was weird. I couldn't move left for some reason. All right. 
bears in a basket. So I would put a teddy bear here. Put in basket. Its limbs make it too big to fit. Okay. Hello, kitty. Hello, hello, kitty. Hello, dear friend. A dusty old drawer. There's nothing inside. It's locked. It's locked. There's a pair of scissors on the workbench. Take them. They're chained to the bench. Oh. Cut off the bare slims? You cut off the teddy bear's limb. That's nice. Four snips for four limbs. Got a teddy bear torso. And why is there so much blood? There are bloody scissors on the workbench. That's not disturbing. I feel like saving again. That's not disturbing. Yes, I know that. A limbless teddy bear read where its limbs were. Put in basket. Stuff the teddy bear torso in the basket. You heard something unlock. I bet that was the door. Okay. I'm not scared. Ah! No! Hello? The floor is littered with teddy bear limbs. Take. We got the teddy bear limbs. The door opened. Check for poison. Okay. An extravagant candle lights up the table. A strangely colored soup in a skull-shaped bowl. Well, it says we have to test it for poison, so I'm not going to do anything with it, because it might be poisoned. The spacious fireplace. I don't choose to do that. What if Santa comes down and he's like, Ho, 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 I'm going to kill you. The cook is busy. Lend a hand. Oh. Jeez, you freaked me out. Don't come out of nowhere like that. Teddy bear torso. What does that mean? Actually, let's look inside since I've saved them now. Nothing but suit. I keep wanting to hold C for... Can I change that? I cannot. Roaches. Can I stop? A book titled Aristocratic Dining. Read. People of ruling and wealthy classes have long enjoyed dining with silverware. Using such hard to clean cutlery proved they were, are, were wealthy enough to hire servants. In addition, silver utensils change color upon contact with poison, making them quite useful. Nothing particularly eye-catching. Nothing particularly eye-catching. Hello. There's someone invisible there. Talk. Ah, I'm busy. So busy. I choose nothing. It's locked. A sink. Bugs swarm around the rusty faucet. Can I get them? Hand over the limbs? Oh, thank you. I was in need of a hand or two. Let me show you my appreciation. Got a silver key. Is that for this door? It's locked. Use key. The key doesn't fit at all. Squash them bugs. Gordon Freeman style. Excellent. They're all dead. Silver, silver, silver. Does that mean... Will a silver key work? 
Hit the key in the soup. That yeah, was poison. The key turned black in the soup. You heard something unlocked. It will crush you. Crush the roaches. The door is open. Let's go inside. Hello. Hey, it's Kitty Cat. Which is good because my timer is about to go off and say, hey, it's time to end up the video. So I'll go ahead and save real quick. A decorative cat ornament. Gotcha. All right, let's save. Are you trying to tell me something with that? That's cheap. I, I wanted that so that way if I die, I don't have to go to the main menu. But instead, you're all like, oh yeah, let's let's give let's give puzzle hints. I don't need puzzle hints. I don't want puzzle hints. I want to figure it out on my own. All right. Well, with that, thank you all very much for watching, and ciao for now. Ciao for now.